Good evening. My name is Kristen Rubin, 26280 Northwest 206th Place, High Springs, Florida. I live on the Santa Fe River. I am a member of our Santa Fe River. I want to share with you five lessons that was learned from the South Florida phosphate mining. One, once given a permit, phosphate mines amend, extend, expand. It is never enough. It is never over. Like a mythological monster, it just grows a new head and continues to exploit the earth and water. Two, heavy rains happen. Phosphate mines spill huge amounts of toxic chemicals and industrial accidents weekly into the aquifer, into the rivers. Three, water use. Voids in the aquifer from over pumping lead to frequent sinkhole activity and other direct contamination of the aquifer. Four, radiation. Once you dig it up, there's no putting it back. It is probably the biggest health problem associated with phosphate mining. The Florida Institute for Phosphate Research did a study in 1985, and the conclusion is that the risk from inhaling odorless, tasteless radon vapors is greater than if you ingest the particles. Five, billion dollar corporations trying over decades have not solved the fundamental problems associated with the waste products of mining. You are asked to believe that an upstart company headed up by four local boys has solved this issue. They have not. Thank you. Walter Brickmark, 